Hey everybody, it's Isaac A. Wardell. I'm a social marketing strategist. In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your Facebook page to Hootsuite so that you can schedule your post for your Facebook page instead of having to post them manually all the time. Now, note before we get started, I am using the Hootsuite Pro versus the free simply because I have more connected profiles than the free version allows. All right, but everything I'm going to show you today can be easily done with the free version. All right, the first thing we've got to do is add a social network. All right, we're going to come over here to Facebook and we're going to say connect with Facebook. And that brings up this screen here, and you have to log in. Whoops. All right, then it's going to load your pages from your Facebook profile. And we're going to add Anderson Tools today. And we're going to say finish importing. All right, and it created a page for us, or a tab rather, because on the last screen we didn't uncheck the mark that said not to. I'm going to delete this events tab and I'm going to actually add a new stream and that's going to be uh, under Facebook here and then we need to select Anderson Tools I'm going to click the scheduled messages this is cool because then you can just see what's scheduled for Anderson Tools alright now we're gonna do an update and we're gonna come up here and say compose update and we're just gonna say this is a test update all right, and then we're going to actually schedule this, and let's just schedule it for sometime in the future here. All right, that looks good to me. Now we do need to select where we're posting it because I have multiple pages up here, so we want to select Anderson Tools. All right, and then we've got everything ready, and we're going to hit schedule. Now, if we refresh this stream, it's going to show up here that this is a test update set to go out on the. 12 10 p.m. of April 30th. Now we can also view this from the publisher tab here. This is a place where all of your scheduled messages would show up. So Monday, April 30th, if you had a bunch of them, different pages and whatnot, or if you had multiple days. So one of the things that my company does is we do a lot of fill in the caption photos or guess the classic year etc but you might also have a photo from say a manufacturers website that you want to post from now the the reason I bring up this unique little thing is because if you're copying images off of the internet you can start to get into copyright issues this is not legal advice I am not a lawyer but one way that we post our photos is if you post it from the URL then if they click on it, they can go directly back to the URL and the correct source gets all the credit and you're just reposting from their hosted place you are not hosting it so let's go ahead and put a picture in there so we're gonna just come up here and click and we're gonna say we want it to go to Anderson tools and we're gonna put the link in here and we're going to shrink it there and it's going to generate a preview and so there's our drill so let's just say dewalt 18 volt drill and let's just say on sale this weekend for $29 alright and then we can actually say something up here in the update such as check out this cool drill now the reason that this is so neat is because you actually get to modify the headline and the description for your photo for when it goes to Facebook instead of just it grabbing whatever uh, garbage link usually would have. So we could actually schedule it but I'm going to go ahead and say send now because I want to show you what this looks like on the Facebook and I'm going to show you another version here in a second of what it would look like if we didn't post that. All right, let's just refresh this page. All right, and as you can see, it says, check out this cool drill, Dewald 18 volt drill on sale this weekend for $29. Now, if we had just come up here and put in the, uh, whoops, if we just come up here and put in the URL 
or put it in here as a link even and said check out this cool drill and selected Anderson tools and said send now oops we uh, wanted to generate a preview so let's just go ahead and, and uh, shrink it there alright and then we'll just say send now and we'll come back over here and refresh and you can see it just puts all of this link stuff in there or if we were to directly paste it from uh, here alright and this is typically what you would get if you uh, just posted with the URL you get this interesting looking stuff so I mean how much better is it to modify the image stuff and say you know all of this information in the when you're scheduling it here by actually when you're shrinking it just taking a couple extra minutes to fill out the header and the description for the tool so let's just go ahead and post it one more time and uh, this time we're going to schedule it alright and we're just going to uh, pick uh, let's see here in the future now if we come over well first of all here it'll start showing up here so now we've got two things scheduled and if we come back over to the publisher we can see multiple days ready here so that's how you can schedule your things in Hootsuite for well in advance and uh, that way you don't have to manually be posting and thinking about what you're going to post each and every day you can have it already done in advance Again, if you want to get your own copy of Hootsuite, there's a link here that you can click. That's my affiliate link for Hootsuite. And uh, you can try it out uh, free version, or you can actually get a 30-day trial of the pro version for free if you want using that link. Hey, if you like this video, I've got a whole lot more great videos and white papers, reports, templates, etc. on the back end of my website at IsaacAwardL.com. All you have to do is head on over there, put in your name and email address, and I will send you a link to where all those resources are hosted at. I look forward to seeing you over there.